TJ Finley, LSU. And this day's been coming for a long time for you, but it's arrived. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels amazing uh, knowing that I have the whole city of Honolulu behind me, uh, supporting me. You know, as I take on to go to LSU, um, it's just an amazing feeling that they're here supporting me. You know, like I said, the city of Honolulu is behind me, so you know I, I need to go up there and make them proud. You know, when they first made you the offer, how long did it take you to make that decision to say yes? Like a uh, second? It was like a couple minutes. You know, I, I, I talked to my family. I was like, you know, this where I want. You know, this where I want to go. This where I want to be for the rest of my. Uh, you know, life, to be honest, you know, like like they always say, it's not a four-year decision, it's a 40-year decision. So, you know, I just made that decision with my family to, you know, make that commitment early and, and stuck with it ever since. Talk about your relationship and impression of Coach Ogeron and, and, and how that's developed. Um, it's, it's very good. Uh, me and Coach Ogeron's relationship is, is so tight. Um, you know, he came in home visit with me uh, two Sundays ago. Uh, we had all his favorites, gumbo, pasta, shrimp, and all that type of stuff. So that goes to show you, you know, how I've been treated uh, at the at LSU and how, you know, he's retreated and uh, he's treated in return. So you know, he's a family guy. You know, he loves family, and, and that's what I'm all about. You watch this offense this year with what uh, Steve Ensminger, Joe Brady, and Joe Burrow have done. Right. Uh, you you kind of. Lick your chops a little bit, salivate yeah, when you absolutely. watch what's going absolutely. on. Yeah, um, you know, knowing that they're putting up them type of numbers uh, in the first year of that offense being incorporated, um, that's just a piece of what it can really do, you know, in the next up uh, years coming. You're confident in your ability to be able to play at that level, aren't you? Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know, you have to be uh, going into one of the, the biggest schools in America. Um, as, a, as a quarterback, you your confident level, uh, confidence level has to be, you know, at the top because you have to lead. Uh, not only the offense, but the defense as well. Last but not least, what do you see as your biggest quality, your best quality as a player? And what do you think you need to work on most? Um, I feel like my best quality is to the, my ability to get others around me involved, others to get uh, get them better. Um, you know, my, my three years here at Pondratula, I feel like I've achieved that goal of, of setting a standard of, of not being, uh, you know, setting a standard of, of coming up to par each game. Uh, you know, win or loss, play your best and leave it all on the field. Uh, I feel like what I need to work on is just um, getting more comfortable with my guys quicker. Um, you know, just making sure they know that I'm a vocal leader and, and making sure they know that they can trust me on the field. TJ, congratulations to you. Thank you. I appreciate it.